welcome back to my channel. So today I have a hair tutorial for you all and this is basically how I do all of my hairstyles. So I very very rarely actually know what I'm going to do with my hair before I start doing it. Um, I find that the more I have a really specific idea in mind, the more I usually can't do it and I get really, really frustrated. So what I do instead is I just play around with rolls in my hair and then it usually comes out quite cute like it did today. So I just turned the camera on, started playing with my hair and this is the result. It's got a little bit of a poodly pin curl section at the top and then these two rolls here and then the empty space I just filled in with a flower so I think this is adorable I really really love how it came out and I hope that you like it as well don't forget that you can follow me on all of my social media you can follow me on Instagram at a very vintage darling and you can follow me on Twitter at V vintage darling to see more of my kind of vintage looks I think this is so pretty I really love it it's very 40s and pretty so I I hope that you are looking forward to seeing how I did this look and let's just get started. We're starting off with essentially third day hair. Um, you can do this on any hairstyle that's had a set in it. I would recommend that there is some curl or texture to it. I have tucked all of the hair that I don't want back and clipped it and we are starting off by just creating a little poodle section. This is how I like to um, do most of my vintage styles. I like to incorporate a little poodle section and then some rolls. I just find that it ends up looking quite cute no matter what you end up doing with it. So I'm just taking small sections using the Lauren Reynolds pin curl sculpture tool which you can use to create pin curls to sleep in or pin curls for a style like this one and rolling the hair down and then pinning to the head. If it's lumpy at all or a bit strange you can fix it with bobby pins as you go. Um, I ended up having to redo a couple of these curls off camera, but the effect is still very cute and you can have curls going in differing directions to give more of a clustered poodle look. Once I've done that, I'm taking a much larger section on the right side of my head and using the Lauren Reynolds Roll and Go tool, which is a slightly larger tool to create a bigger kind of victory roll, which I am then pinning to my head. Then on the other side of my head, I'm taking all of the hair below the poodle and above my ear, um, backcombing ever so slightly at the roots, and then again using the Lauren Reynolds Roll and Go to roll it up to my head. And I'm lifting this quite high so that it meets the poodle section, so there's no sort of gaps in the hairstyle. I want it to be kind of continuous and for each section to roll into the next. I've had plenty of daddies, and you ain't the worst. Like now spray the living heck out of it with your trusty old hairspray. I'm taking the clips out that held the sections I didn't want back and then I'm just brushing through the hair into a nice smooth shape. This is going to be held up with a hair net in a second. I really recommend getting hair nets that match your hair colour. I have a brunette one. This just makes it a lot less obvious that you're wearing one and it looks really smooth and elegant. It's also really good if it's bad weather. <laughs> then to fill in that gap on the other side, I'm taking a big cream hair flower and sliding that in. I think it looks so, so beautiful. I love to fill gaps in hairstyles with hair flowers. I think it looks really pretty and vintage and just adds to the look. And then any spare bits that are fluffing up, you can fix with bobby pins or hairspray. I would suggest to you. Suggest to your heart. I think it's the best to do. So jump in my Ford. Holler all aboard. He, I want to be. By the sea. By the sea. By the beautiful sea. You and I. You and I. Oh, how happy we'll be. I can't. 
I can do my hair quite well, but I can't do other people's hair because when I'm doing my hair, I just, it just happens. Like this was not planned. This just happened. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> By the beautiful sea.